Hi, my name is Chris Jacobs. I'm the creator of Vallejo Historic Home Support. Uh, today we're going to talk about some backup power uh, sources that you can use. For example, if PG&E shuts your power off as they did uh, during the wildfire season of 2018 and they almost certainly will continue to do probably every single year. Some people I know have solar and solar is pretty expensive. Uh, we may all have solar at some point and pieces of what's on this table it, are involved with solar. And the very first thing we're going to talk about is a small little power station. So this is, it's about 100 watts, it's about $100, and it's really only good for charging your cell phone. And actually, my cell phone was dying when I got here, so I plugged it in. I'm, I'm charging my phone right now. I was at one uh, battery bar when I came. I'm now at 13%, and that was maybe uh, 25 minutes ago. Turned it on and started charging. This particular one, uh, and there'll be a link for this one, I actually chose it when I bought it because it has a flashlight. And I just thought, you know what, these days, no one has a flashlight. We all have cell phones. We use our cell phones for flashlights. And this is to charge your cell phone if your cell phone's dead. So maybe you want the flashlight. That's a unique feature. It comes with AC. It comes with DC. On the back, it has quick charge ports. You can charge your uh, your phone here from this. And it's really just meant there's not a lot of power in this. And we're going to get to that. You could charge your cell phone maybe six times, and this would die. Um, you pro tra probably charge your computer if it was all the way down, you could probably charge it one and a half times, something like that. Uh, it says 155 watt hours, but I gotta guess that the amperage is really low on that because uh, it, it doesn't, it's not, it's, it's really what it is, it's a lithium ion battery that you'd have in your cell phone, only a little bit bigger as a backup power uh, source. Okay, the next thing we're gonna do, check out the next video, we're gonna talk about power inverters. Power inverters are ways to pull power off a of battery and turn it into AC specifically how to turn your car into a generator for your house.